Okay, so top five weird designer items. I feel like I don't speak about designer brands too, too much, and that ain't even on purpose. It's just, it's just the way it is. All right, cool. So coming in at the number five spot, we have the Balenciaga potato chip bag. And also, let's do a quick game with all of these items. So I want everyone to try and guess the retail price for these items. And obviously, if you get it right, then let me know in the comments. But, you know, I doubt that you'll get it right because, yeah, the price on these are actually fuckery. But anyway, let's talk about this fuckery, yeah, because potato chip bag, what? Who knew having a potato chip bag in your hand would be classed as drip? I mean, if it's really classed as drip, then you, you are speaking to the most drippiest motherfucker to walk this earth because the amount of potato chip bags that I've had in my hand are fucking crazy. All right, cool. So try and guess the price of this now, yeah? So the price of this Balenciaga potato chip fuckery bag is 1.8k. 1.8k, I can go down to my local supermarket, yeah, get 10 of these fuckers for like £2.50. Balenciaga, what are you doing? Like, I really despise this brand, I'm not even joking, and this brand needs to be shut down ASAP. And you already know that this isn't the only Balenciaga item on this list, so yeah, just look out for the next item. Alright, cool, so coming in at the number 4 spot, we have the chain chair bag. And I can't even call this a bag, because what the hell is this holding? Like, you... There ain't even a zip on it where you can zip it up or, you know, a thing to put your stuff. It's just, it's just a chair on a chain. This isn't necessarily weird, but it's just fuckery. Like, why would you pay for this? What are you, like, what are you doing? It's not drip. It's not even an actual chain because it just hangs, like, down like a bag. And I'm not going to say the price tag is understandable for this, but I would have thought the price tag would be a, a lot higher than it actually is. But, yeah, anyway, the price tag of this is $895. And if you are buying this, I hope God does save your soul because, yeah, you are you are just a lost person in, in general. And, um, yeah, that's going to be it for the number four spot. Okay, cool. So, coming in at the number three spot, and I thought Machina was a relatively certy brand, but after seeing this, it just throws all of my respect out the window. But, yeah, anyway, coming in at the number three spot, we have the baguette bag. And what the hell is this? To be fair though, yeah, there is one good use that could, could come out of this. So say if you are rocking this and you're walking down, down the street and someone comes to try and rob you and like takes your phone, takes whatever's in your pockets, they're not going to take whatever it is in this because they just think it's a normal baguette. But in the same sense, what are you doing rocking around with this? Are you trying to get laughed at? Are you trying to get bullied? Are you trying to look like a dickhead? Because we, you with this are all of them things. The price tag of this, guess the price tag, have it in your mind. So the price tag for this is 1170 buff buff. Yep, crazy price tag. I'm not surprised. It's Machino and yeah. All right, and now we have the godfather of designer brands. You, yes, you have guessed it, Louis Vuitton. Okay, Louis Vuitton. Okay, cool. So the item that I am going to be talking about is none other than the airplane bag. And this isn't necessarily pointless or boring, but it's just weird. Obviously, there is a use case that could be made out of this. Obviously, you could put your bag, you could put your phone. Obviously, you're not, you're not going to put your bag inside a bag, but, you know, you, you could put some stuff in this bag. So, obviously, there is a use case for this, but imagine just lugging this around. Obviously, you've got the wings. Imagine trying to fit fit through a door in this. Like, it's just, it's just a no-no. And, yeah, it's just a lot going on. Obviously, I'm not going to hate on it as much as all the other items, but in terms of weirdness, this is definitely up there in terms of weirdness. And don't even chat to me about the price tag, yeah, because this is the most expensive item on this entire list. I don't even think you're ready, yeah, because the price tag that you're thinking of, you might as well times it by 10. All right, I want a lot of you to get this, yeah, so I'm going to give you a clue, yeah. It is between 20000 and 70000 In between there, it is a whole number, okay? So are you thinking of a number? Okay, cool. So the price tag for this thing is forty thousand dollars. Yes, you heard me four zero 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 But yeah, that is actually a crazy just item in general But yeah, anyway coming in at the number one spot We have another Balenciaga fuckery item and this actually grind my gears So coming in at the number one spot We have the water bottle flip-flops and this is just jarring. This is really just jarring. I don't know if they're taking the piss out of like African people for, you know, only, only having water and now they have water on their shoes or like they I don't know in it. Like it's just it's just very annoying. And um yeah, I actually hate Balenciaga on a different level. Brother, I, I can make these flip-flops at my house for less than less than less than five pounds, you know? And you can give it points for creativity, but in terms of weirdness, it's just it's just straight up there. And Balenciaga have just gone too far in terms of trying to build a name for themselves for releasing just weird items. And yeah, just a not a good look. And yeah, I'm just very annoyed with this one, to be fair. But anyway, the price for this thing, um, just try and guess it, whatever, whatever. Um, the price of this is $895. I'm not even going to say it's reasonable because it's, it's water bottles. Water bottles cost like 
a pound or something and yeah it's just yeah just fuckery but um yeah that is going to be it for today's video i, I hope you did enjoy uh, if you want to see more videos like this um i can certainly do that and yeah without further ado it's been your boy i'm out